I want to react to the tweet that Casper uh, Nyovest uh, actually made. He posted a tweet showing love to AKA's new album, Mass Country. As we all know, these guys have been having the never ending beef. That's why this post is shocking for some people. But honestly, what I want to say is that just me my opinion guys you are entitled to yours as long as we keep everything civil and respectful as long as we don't insult each other at the end of the day because there are people who are who just enjoy insulting people guys i don't know if whether maybe there is the style of social media or what whenever you try and voice your opinion someone just because they don't agree with you they'll want to make sure that they win the thing but we are not here to win we are here to just try and balance things guys and to some people this post uh, they didn't take it well and they were saying that why is it that Casper is trying to show love to AKA after his passing why didn't he do that whilst AKA was alive and what I want to say guys as for me the way I've observed things usually people they fight like when we are together like this in real life living, we tend to fight, we tend to disagree. But the minute someone goes, guys, that's when you will realize that you actually loved that person. That's when you actually realize that, honestly, it's not like I really hated that person to a point that I would want to see them gone. You know, fighting is there all the time. We fight all the time, but uh, it doesn't mean that we want to wish each other bad. Just like what happened after AKE passed, there are some people who were trying to say the post, the, the tweet that Casper uh, uh, made. He was actually, they said that if maybe he had made that tweet after, they were going to believe that he has something to do with AKE's passing. Fortunately, he did that tweet like early in the morning on that day. And people were already trying to rub it on him. Honestly, I want to believe, guys, life is too short to hold grudges. To hold grudges, especially grudges that, uh, that are permanent. For me, I'm the kind of a person that just... I'll, I'll have beef with someone, but I normally don't uh, exceed t too much time. Like, if I have beef with you, it's just for today. Tomorrow, I've even forgotten. Maybe you'll still be grumbled grumbling over the whole thing but for me i would have forgotten you are the one that will get to remind me that have you forgotten that you made me angry yesterday but honestly i don't i don't want to live my life that way because i believe that my heart is for pumping blood my heart is not for keeping petty things you know i fight with you today tomorrow i'm good we move, we move, guys. We open another page. But there are those people that don't close chapters. They don't close chapters. And for me, I always believe that those kind of people, they're the ones that can actually turn into witches. <laughs> they're the ones that can turn into witches. Because if you do not forgive, how do you want to be forgiven yourself? If maybe tomorrow you do something wrong to someone, how do you want people to just let it go and just move on? If you can do it. That's why I always say, do unto others what you would love done unto you. I just want to say that, guys, honestly, those that are blaming Casper, can they please give the poor guy a break? I believe it's really, he's feeling so bad. He's feeling so bad. We don't want a situation of Ricky Ricky right now, guys. We don't want to end up... Casper feeling so bad to a point that he will just, you know, close out. It's not okay. I don't think they really hated each other. It was just, you know, a rivalry. You know how it happens when you are running the same show? You get to a point where you feel like, I want to be the best, I want to be. But I don't really want to believe, like, deep down, if the uh, jobs were to be taken from them, they will still do the same thing. I just that's what I wanted to say, guys. That's I just wanted to react to that and just point my concerns. Let me know what you think. Do you think uh, it's okay for Casper to be persecuted like this? 
Let me know down there in the comment section and please remember to keep your comments civil and respectful, guys. I'll see you on the next video. And may Ikhi continue to rest in eternal peace. It's a good night from me.